Today we are making a Cantonese chicken wing potato stew. Hi guys, I'm Andrew. Welcome back to Cantonese Food Recipes. Wow, it has been a long, long week. I haven't been making recipes, but today I'll be showing you guys how to make this delicious chicken wing stew. Mm, my mom taught me this. So guys, uh, let's get started with the recipe. Okay guys, so over here I've got uh, 10 to 12 chicken wings. You can add more if you like. So I'm adding here one teaspoon of salt. And then I'm just also going to sprinkle some black pepper. And also sprinkle some white pepper or all around the chicken wings. And obviously we need our chicken powder so I'm adding in here one teaspoon of chicken powder and here I have some sugar so I'm adding two teaspoons of sugar and so first we added in our dry ingredients so we're just gonna give it a quick five minute mix now we add in our wet ingredients here I've got one tablespoon of Chinese rice wine I'm adding in two tablespoons of soy sauce I'm adding in one tablespoon of sesame oil and one tablespoon of olive oil and finally one tablespoon of oyster sauce these are like our main uh, ingredients that we marinate our chicken wings with and then we also give that a quick mix for five minutes and then we'll let it marinate for 30 minutes so let's prepare some uh, spices and ingredients so here i'm chopping up a uh, garlic clove and I also chop up some uh, ginger then over here here is the onion i'm just chopping up one onion we need some onion for good chicken stew guys okay you can't forget about the tomatoes. The tomatoes give the stew a very tomato flavor. Chopping up like four tomatoes here. And then finally, we have to have our carbs. So here is some potatoes. The potatoes here, I'm just chop, I'm just cutting them into thinner slices so that when we boil them, it will, it will become uh, more mushy. It will be easier for it to cook. So we're just going to let that boil for about 20 minutes or longer. And then we're just going to drain that and rinse it with some cold water. Okay guys, so that's all we need. So let's uh, start making the dish. So here I have a wok and I'm just preheated and I'm adding in some olive oil. Just give that a good rinse around the wok and then we'll add in our ginger, garlic and onions and give that a good 5 minute stir fry. Get all that flavor out of those ingredients and then we'll add in our chicken wings with all that sauces and, and spices that we marinated the chicken wings with and give that a quick uh, five to seven minute uh, stir fry then we will add in our tomatoes and give that a stir fry as well with the chicken wings okay stir fry that for five minutes and then we can add in some uh, hot water so guys uh, hot water you can add in your desired amount because basically it will be will be, um, will be uh, stewing this with the potatoes so add enough water to be stewed with the potatoes so here's our secret sauce for the stew we're adding in one teaspoon of bean sauce and here is chi hao sauce 
We're also going to be adding in one heaped teaspoon. And then we're going to just give that quick mix into our chicken stew. Let that cook. Let it start to boil up. Okay, once um, it starts to boil up, we can add in our potatoes. Look at those thinly sliced potatoes that have been boiled already. So this stew, uh, we're just going to be covering this uh, with the lid with for about for about 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, we can uh, add in some cornstarch water. So over here, we just mixed in one tablespoon of cornstarch into some cold water. And just going to pour that into our chicken stew and just give it a quick mix. The cornstarch will thicken up the sauce and it will stick onto our potatoes and our chicken wings. That's what we want the sauce. So we have a saucy stew. So cover that back with a lid and then cook it for five more minutes and voila, the dish is ready guys. So it's that simple and it's a quick and delicious dinner guys. So guys, if you like my recipe, please give it a try and let me know how it went. And please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks guys for watching. See you guys next time.